Hi guys, my name is Mix and this is my second video. This is a makeup tutorial on this look. This is, I created this look um, just out of the blue and it's, it's an easy eye with a bold lip. I hope you like it. Keep on watching. Hi guys. Let's get started. For foundation, I'm going to use this Lots of Love Liquid Foundation in the shade number 3, Sand Beige. I'm just going to put some product in the back of my hand and use a sponge. You can use whatever you want. Brush or sponge will be nice. When you're using a sponge, you want to dab or pat the product into your skin you don't want to swipe it because it'll leave streak marks on your face and you don't want that and then do the same on the other side of the face for powder i'm going to use this caroline oil control face powder in the shade tan I'm first going to set my under eye with this powder using patting motions. Because this powder is lighter than my skin tone, I'm going to focus it on the high points of my face, the under eye areas the bridge of the nose, the forehead, and the chin. I'm taking a brush, set the other areas of the face. For contour, I'm going to use the Sand Sand Eyeshadow in the shade Deep Earth Brown. Then start contouring your face, following the natural hollows of your cheeks. And do the same on the other side of the cheek. I'm just gonna speed this up so it won't take long. Also, put it on the sides of the forehead and if you want on your jawline. Then I'm gonna start contouring my nose. You don't have to take this if you don't want. Don't forget to blend. We'll move to brows. For brows, I use this Lots of Love Eyebrow Pencil in Brown and an Angle Liner Brush. I start doing brows by creating a line on the lower part of my brows starting from the front part of my brows up to the tail. I focus the product on the tail end of my brows because that's where I have less hair. Taking that angled liner brush and blend out the product. Then I'm going to use a spoolie to blend out more. You really can't go wrong with blending. Then for the eyes, as a primer, I use the same foundation and then set it with the powder that I use with my face. As you can see, I'm using pattern motions 
because eyes can be sensitive you don't want to swipe it Then I'm gonna take the same brown color that I used for my contour and put it all over my crease. If you don't know where your crease is, just push your lid and when you find that hollow part, that's where your crease is. This eye look is very simple. Basically, that brown shade is the only thing we're gonna put on our lid. Then I'm gonna take this e.l.f. Duo Eyeshadow in the shade High Tide. It's from the Ariel collection. I'm gonna use a gold shade to highlight the inner corners and the brow bone. Then taking any liner that you have, I'm gonna take the same pencil that I use for my brows. I'm gonna put it on the waterline and the lash line to smoke out my lower lash line. Then I'm gonna take the same eyeshadow that I used for my crease and use it to smoke out the lower lash line. You can use any neutral brown that you have. just gonna curl my lashes with the Everbelena Lash Curler. Wait and dance as you curl your eyes. Then I'm gonna apply a thin coat of mascara with my Victoria's Secret mascara. I'm right handed so I need to do this. <laughs> I'm just gonna apply my false lashes and I'll be right back. And lashes are on now I'm gonna finish off my face starting with blush I'm gonna use this blush I forgot where it came from I think it's from HBC I'm gonna use that pink shade as my blush and for highlight I'm gonna take the same gold shade that I used to highlight my inner corners and highlight my cheekbones. I'm also gonna highlight my cupid's bow and my nose. Now for lips. For lips, I'm gonna take this Maybelline Color Show lip color in the shade Barely Nude. And on top, I'm gonna take this Intense Color Gloss from Victoria's Secret in the shade Raspberry Chic.
And that's it for today's video. I hope you like it. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye!